rolling, rolling on the river. Ah. Hey, we good. We rolling. Hopefully nobody kicks his mother goddamn tripod over. Man. I'll beat their ass like that. <laughs> No, I'm just saying they might kick it on accident. No, nah, nah, that's too far. I'm gonna put it over here. For real, man. That's that's too far out there. I'll put it right here. I mean, sorry. Say he broke his leg. Oh, his tripod leg or his? Oh, he took off running. Oh wow. He ain't getting nowhere. Saying, the angel waited for the perfect time, probably went to that motherfucker, fell on the toilet, I mean, sat on the toilet, and stroked out or some shit. You know, yeah. taking a shit. Died like Elvis. <laughs> right. right. Angels don't let nobody get away with shit, man. Nobody. Yeah, really? You know? It's impossible for a motherfucker to get away with something. That's why your boy Leonard's bugged out. <laughs> right. I told you if I see Leonard tonight, I'm chasing him with the camera. <laughs> Told my fucking phobia with beers or whatever the fuck he said. He said my beard was too long, but yours was okay. So did he say that? Yeah, he said. Oh, really <laughs> Ain't that a bitch? I'm gonna call what you. I have a beard. I call him bullshit ass goat feet. I, if I see uh, Leonard, I'm gonna chase his ass. Hell yeah. He gonna run out to a coda bus. Hey, 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 hey. Be like Frog. Look on the internet. You look yeah, on the internet and see this uh, phobia or some shit. So anybody that believes in Yahweh Shai, uh, you're supposed to you're supposed to embrace that brother and help him out, teach him. You know what I mean? You ain't supposed to be because uh, you got a lot of these Israelite groups out here. They they might say if you believe in the truth, they might reject you because you look a certain way. You know? But the Lord said if anybody had one of these little ones that believe in him, you, you might as well just go pretty much commit suicide. Go kill yourself. Put a millstone around your neck and throw your ass in the sea. That's right, that's right. Uh, yeah, keep going. Woe unto the world because of offenses. Yeah, woe unto the world because of the offenses. Because well, people are always like, well, if God is if God is so good, then how come how come there's so much evil in the world? You know what I mean? Well read that again. Woe well, to the world because of offenses. For it must need yeah. be that a man we'll come. But woe to the man, woe to that man by whom oh, the offense is coming. Hey, oh. Yeah, I just don't. Mm, this motherfucker might. Yeah, we can do that. I just don't want nobody to hit it. Go ahead. Yeah, that would be better. Yeah, that's cool. That, that, yeah, that would be good. Go ahead. Read that again. Woe to the world because of offenses. For it needs be that offenses come. But woe to that man by, by whom the offense one of these, is coming. Stand right here. One of these legs is broken right here. Wherefore, if thy hand or thy foot offend thee, cut them off and cast them from, from thee, it is better for thee to enter into life or to remain rather than having two hands or two feet to be cast into the everlasting fire. 
Looks like cold blooded, man. Yeah, the mo yeah, yeah people. Cold -blooded, man. They people always try to. They be like, "Well, God is all loving. He would never hurt. God did not create hate and pain. No, the Most High created all kinds of hate, right? All kinds of pain, destruction, famine, desolation, pestilences." But what these motherfuckers don't understand is the Most High is uh, he's balanced, and you know he 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 wants complete order. Yeah. So motherfuckers, uh, I mean, mu uh, murmuring behind brothers' backs. Yeah, murmur. Ain't nothing worse than a murmur. I mean, especially a brother that's brotherly. You know what I'm saying? And these motherfuckers go home. These motherfuckers gonna know the Bible. Ain't Talking they? shit. Teaching this shit. Teaching uh, that shit. I see him. He was eating a. Uh, he was eating a. Uh, <laughs> a watermelon. Oh, watermelon. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> right, 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 right. Oh, he, oh this is scriptural now. Oh, he don't, he didn't, I, I seen him at the store, at the grocery store. He didn't have no fringes. Mm -hmm. Just right, try right. to call you right. out on every stupid little thing. Shit. Stupid yeah. shit. You know, stupid shit. It's, you got people out there that think wearing fringes is going to save you. So we, right. We got fringes, but it ain't going to save you. The fringes ain't saving you. Damn sure hell ain't. But like you were saying, like they, like they act like the most high don't do none of that. Yeah. I mean, that's why they call him the creator. Yeah, he's the creator. <laughs> he's the he's the creator. That means he created everything. So if you believe in a God, if you if your God if you say your God did create evil, then that means he's not the creator. <laughs> you worshiping some low level demon. You know yeah. what I mean? Check this out. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Check this out. This is Ecclesiastes ten and twenty. Curse not the king. No, not in thy thought, and curse not the rich in thy bedchamber, for a bird of the air shall carry the voice. Oh, yeah, because you got people that might want to, uh, right now, we really don't have, like, an actual king. You know, we got elders, right? But you got people like to murmur against the teachers and the elders. They talk about them behind their back. They, they you know, they want to uh, dispute every last little teaching. And, really? Yep. And then, then they try to come up with their own doctrine and start perverting the, the truth, talking well, little shit. Well, we are the rich. <laughs> you know, we have this wisdom. Yeah, like you said, a little bird. If you talk about someone behind their back, that, that little bird's going to carry what you said away. Mm -hmm. it's gonna Check come, it out. Little, gonna, little, uh, little sparrow. Little, bird, little bugs that fly. Yeah. Well, anything. Yeah, man. anything. That's most high's creation. Anything. You know? But it, it, that, what... That shit that you was talking is gonna come back on you like a boomerang. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers still carry boom boxes and shit? Wow. I wish I had a boom box. <laughs> the one from the eight, remember back in the 80s, yeah. it came on your shoulder? Yeah. Radio should be Raheem, bumping like boom. Some, some Radio Raheem shit. Batteries oh, yeah. last a half hour. Do the right thing. Do the right thing. Yeah. Like, man, I watched yeah. that movie literally about a thousand times, man. That was, that was a pretty good movie. Yeah. I used to have one of the boom boxes. I had a BC yeah, Boys yeah, tape yeah, up in it. Yeah, yeah. Where the license the ill. I had so I don't even know how many box, back beat boxes. I, I had that in the fat boys. Right. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, curse and curse not the rich in thy bedchamber, for the bird of the air sh shall carry the voice, and that which hath wings shall tell the matter. <laughs> I mean, it's like the most high God. I mean, his eyes everywhere, like I said. Yeah. I, I, I'd be I, like, because so, people might, you talk shit to me. You, you know what I mean? I'd be like, okay, whatever. Here you, go. you know what I'm saying? I'll, I'll keep an eye on your ass. Yeah, motherfuckers like talking shit. Yeah, people love talking shit about people behind their back. They always think they're better than somebody. Wow, that makes them feel bad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah everybody it, it's, it's for their, um, it feeds their, uh, their spirit. Ego, their ego. You know, their wicked ass spirit. Such a man only feareth the eyes of men, and knoweth not that the eyes of the Lord are ten thousand times brighter than that of the sun, beholding all the ways of men and considering the most secret parts. Yep. So that, that's just like that Amos 9 and 8 that says the eyes of the Lord are upon the sinful kingdom. America. The most, yeah, the most high sees everything. Literally. Every. Esau thinks he can see everything with his uh tracking you with the cell phone. Cheap shit. Yeah, thinks he can see you with the like you notice now. I was, yeah. I was trying like, to yeah. set up a new email account. Did you notice like nowadays you can't even get an email account without putting your phone number in? A yeah, cell phone you number? You you it's like I don't even want I don't even want an email no more. Like why you why do you need my phone number? 
What if I don't have a phone? Yeah, I don't, you can't about set up an email. No, because I don't have a phone. You know right. what I mean? I don't have I don't have phone service. So I can't. It's hard to even get a fucking email account because they want to track your every last move. They want to make it, sure they know who's using that account. It accept those um, you know what I mean? The fake ones? They, they yeah, used to. The they don't no more. The, uh, they don't work no more. All straight up? Nope. Damn. They used to work. Wow. I used to use them pinger numbers on YouTube to make all them extra channels. Now, why well, I tried to make a new YouTube channel, it, they don't accept those pinger numbers. It's like this number is invalid. <laughs> Start using people's numbers. That's know. why they did locking shit down on the internet, man. That's what I'm gonna start doing. Use people's numbers I knew. Oh, that's how you do it. <laughs> but yeah, man, you gotta get a text though. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh yeah, you gotta verify. Yeah, you yeah. don't motherfuckers so, verify well, we, anyway. You, you guys have been doing your thing here for as long as I've worked here. Oh, yeah. I know you hate Eddie George. How long I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay. Hey, we hate what? You hate Eddie George's, right? Well, <laughs> well no. You work at Eddie George's? For about eight years. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> it ain't we hate Eddie George's. We're con we're just condemning. And we're just not part of this world. Right, right. You know, this is not our world. We're not part of You're it. You're allowed. Yeah, everybody's allowed to you know have I mean? their own opinions, yeah. their own feelings. Fuck. I mean, we watch football and shit. I watched the Buckeyes game Saturday. Yeah, you hate this, right? I mean, I mean, <laughs> I've never liked Michigan my whole life. I'm from, I'm from Columbus. You know I remember when you guys did it over there. <laughs> that's right. That's oh, the yeah. That's, and, when, that's and, when we was crazy. Was like we, had to, we had to boot right y'all. Yeah. Boot us? Yeah. He didn't yeah. boot us. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. No. Mm -hmm. No? No. You no sure? one's never moved us from nowhere. No. Nah. Is that true? It, it ain't possible. <laughs> Not a cops will possible. come out a few times, but... Yeah. Well, didn't you guys try to do it on the patio up front here? Uh-uh. Uh -uh. That might have been, I don't know. I no. doubt that. No, I've never. We've this always been. The gays were It's over been there. a hot second. Yeah. You don't remember the gays were over there with signs? Yeah. Oh, yeah, they were over there with yeah, signs, but not us. Yeah. That was. I. I had a hand in. But we're not trying to hate on anybody. We just. just <laughs> we have. You know. We have bosses. They're like, look, dick face. You got to get these guys out of here. What am I supposed to do? I'm like, all right. <laughs> Actually, we move. We used to teach right here in front of the sign. I'm a big fan of Jesus. I. I'm a Buddhist, but I love Jesus. A Buddhist? Of course. That's because it's trendy. That's I'm a soldier. That's what's trendy right oh, now. man. That's what uh, I learned overseas. What was your name? Army? Army. Ranger. Army Ranger? Yeah. I served I was in, in the Bosnia, Marines. Korea, Iraq. Who goes in first? Who goes Iraq, in first? The Marines. The Marines. Special operations. We used to no, make the we... Rangers go in first. No, it's the Marines going first. The Marines are the 911. Only when it's a... A dummy contest. You know? Yeah. When they want so they smart the guys to go in. in. First, the army. That's what's considered the pawns. They're all pawns. Right. They're all pawns. Yeah, but the, it, there is order yeah. in the military too. There is order. You know. Right. Yep. Right. Yep. I, I, um, you know, the army got a new I worked commander. For, I worked for NATO. Okay. When yeah. we went to Bosnia. North American Treaty Organization. Back in the nineties. So yeah. yeah. So they just threw us all in together with every different military you can think of. Yeah. You know, and said, live. And do what you're supposed to do. Right, right, right. Bosnia. That That's like, when I Bosnia. set aside Christianity and got in with Buddhism. Buddhism. But it, what is, yeah, but Buddhism is a. Uh, there's nothing to Buddhism. It's, it's like a, it's a, it's a, it's a. I got a jet. Okay. It's good to see you. Yeah, I'll, I'll see you next week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't need to get into it. Yeah, it's a, it's a fruitless endeavor. <laughs> There's the spirit though, how he come up and talk about how they were doing the movements and this and that. Yeah, he said he had a part in it. So. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's right with the facts. Yeah. With the facts, you know. And you see how the Most High shut that shit down. And they ain't, yeah. we ain't seen one of the motherfuckers. And it was a lot of them. We ain't seen not one of them around here. And it's been years between now and then, man. Yeah, you know? I noticed I don't see the. A while back, there was these two bitches that used to always come around her skull. The one was black, the other one was white. All right. Was it a couple? It was like friends or something. I remember the black girl, the black and white couple. No, I don't think, I don't think it was a couple, a couple, but the, the dark skinned chick, she had big ass bug eyes. Oh, yeah, I remember that bug eyed bitch. Yeah, I remember yeah. they were standing over on the corner, yeah, all bugged yeah. out. Like, I ain't never seen that. That was a long time ago, yeah, wasn't it? That was good. Last time I see them bitches. Yeah, we out here, man. We still bugging people out, man. They still with their mouths open, like, what the fuck? That, that, that only verifies it's not for them. Now, yeah. We, yeah, we just back in the day, we were, we was bringing the truth out, but that's back when we was wild and crazy, you know. But now we're now we're now we're a little more 
seasoned. You know, we, have, we know how to handle these fools better now. You know what I mean? Yep. Oh yeah, if that dude would have came up five years ago, I would have just cussed his ass out. Like, you <laughs> faggot bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of my face. I could have sworn that was dude that showed and pulled his dick out though. It might have been. I, I, I could have sworn. It, it could have been. been. It probably was. I, well, that happened more than once. Oh, yeah, that's Motherfuckers right. love to pull right. their dick out. I pull their rod out, man. That's some faggot shit. I gotta read that script. Watch out, you get escaped. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. Did y'all walk by the water down there? <laughs> on, that, on that other side, where the crazy people in the apartment? Uh, oh yeah, the crazy oh, did we? apartment. Yeah, uh, dude, I, yeah, yeah, I yeah, yeah. Crossed over. Now we anyway, walked right up. Two black bitches just walking. A car came by. And ain't no water nowhere else but right there. They got that window, There's a leak coming up the still used apartment. Oh yeah, they. Was, and, yeah. And, and, and the water and it hit a perfect. Oh. And one of them screamed, "I got this, my man!" Man, I was on the other side cracking up, man. That's beautiful. Yeah, it was beautiful, man. It was beautiful as hell. I praise the Lord, man. Yeah, I love seeing these bitches get fucked up. Two big booty ass nasty with the black bitches. Shit. <laughs> but, but ass probably covering the herpes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a funny shit, though. I ain't gonna go for it. Matthew 18 and 10. Take heed that you despise, that you despise not one of these little ones. For I say unto you that in heaven their angels do always behold the face of my Father which is in heaven. <laughs> that goes up. We was talking about them angels earlier. Oh, is that the one you were looking for? Yeah. That's a good scripture. Yeah. Space. That means keep it real, keep it 100. Yeah, because the angels don't sleep. The angels don't go to bed. You think the angels get tired, like, oh, time to go to sleep? It's nap time. No, the yeah, angels yeah. is 24 7 on it. They, is not, they don't sleep, they don't need to rest. They don't need to study. They don't, they don't eat, they don't shit, they don't sleep. Right, they don't need to study. They're, they're immortal. Right, super right, right. They, they don't have sex. No need to bust a fucking nut. They just, you know what they're doing? They're working. They're doing the work of the most high. Right. Constantly. Right. Non-stop. In a way, we can't even comprehend. Yeah, we just, you get bugged out even trying to, yeah, you get bugged out trying to comprehend it. Right. If you see an angel, you'll fall down to your knees. Every time an angel appeared in the Bible, <laughs> Daniel fell to his knees, John fell to his knees. Yes, Yep. That should make you weak in the knees. Yeah, because you know, that, that's so much that power. Present. Abraham, um, who else? Uh, Samson's parents. Uh, oh, uh, David, uh, the angel. Tobit, in the book of Tobit. Yep, yep. That shit goes on and on, man, the, the fear yeah. of the angels, man. Each one. Yep, yep. You know, the angels ain't nothing to fuck with either. Oh, you know, these motherfuckers will have a movie or, or portray it like an angel appear there. They're just, oh, I love you. Oh, come here, give me, you know. Oh, no, it's a wonderful life. Oh, right, right. <laughs> He's, it's that, a wonderful life. He has life. to get his wings. You so know. His mother said he was like terrible or something like that. Mm -hmm. Beautiful, terrible, you know. A beauty that's terrifying. You remember that Russian cosmonaut that said he seen an angel? Mm -hmm. looked, he said it was a giant Celestial being with wings that had a human face. That's crazy. He's up out. Imagine, imagine seeing something like that, man. I'm gonna start at, I'm start at, uh, sorry. I'm gonna start at 18. Second Chronicles 18 to 18. And he said, Therefore, hear the word of Yahweh. I saw. I was sitting upon his throne, you know, the host of heaven, standing on his right hand, on his left hand. Um, Yahweh said, Who shall entice Ahab, king of Israel, that he may go up and fall at Ramoth Gali? I think it's it. And one back saying after this manner, and another saying after that manner, that, I mean, then there came out of spirit and stood before Yahweh and said, I will entice him. And Yahweh said unto him, Wherewith, and he said, I will go out and be a lying spirit in the mouth of all of his prophets. Deceive the shit out of them. You know? Yeah. That tells you how most lie don't be. Oh, really? You know, these people think the most high is just a sweet individual. Right. You know, you want to talk about the real mafia. He sent his henchmen and that's impossible to literally escape. Hell, the, the henchmen know your thoughts. <laughs> that's a bad story right here, though. How it said, thou shalt entice him, and thou shalt also prevail. Go out and do even so. That's just funny, man. Yes, I do. Yeah, yeah, right. Yes, 
Satan. You're Satan. Yep, yep. It makes you like, wow, you know. That is bad, though. That is bad. These people are just going to be stuck on stupid, just like I think it's that's in the sense that uh, he's going to send them a false delusion. Yeah. Oh, is that yeah. Am I correct? Yeah, false. Uh, uh, a strong, strong delusion. A strong delusion. Strong delusion. That's, that's, that's it. Let me get it. That's all right. And the angels was all, always there in almost every story. Like, uh, even when we remember when Joshua was going up to fight all the Canaanites going to the promised land, and the Most High said, I'll just give you an angel to guide you over the river and all that. You remember how the Most High split the Red Sea? Yeah. He must split one of them rivers when they was going up into the promised land. What sure was that? Did. Sure did. Yeah. It's a lot. With, um, with, um, In the book of Joshua. Uh, he did a lot. Had the water come out the bottom and uh, the, the cherry. Thessalonians 2 and 11. Yeah, I'm not sure I got it in half. Yeah. Oh, this one right here. Yeah, bring that out real quick. Yeah, right, quick um, yeah it's been only two. Right. two paragraphs. This is pretty much what we was talking about earlier about like how people doing all type of crazy shit, thinking that the most high is not going to come or do nothing, pretty much. He already is doing something. It's about to be goddamn World War Three. You ain't see that missile they just shot off the coast of California? Woo. The U.S. testing the missiles? Mm -hmm. yeah. You didn't see that? Everybody uh, thought it was a UFO or a spaceship. Oh, yeah, I seen the news clip. That, 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 was a, that was a missile. But I ain't read it, though. I don't know. Did you, did you see it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Plus, when you look at it before it lit up, you can see uh, I don't know, man. I've never seen I don't a, know, man. I don't I've never know. seen a chariot look like that, though. I don't know. I think I don't it was know. a missile. When it lit up, it was kind of weird. The, but the government said it was testing missiles. But the thing is, if it was a missile, why would it be just sitting there in that yeah, one it spot? Did, it did. Man, it had to be up really high. And the higher up something is, the slower it moves. It looks slow. No, so who no, knows? You don't know. No. You're right. You're right. You don't I mean, know. You never I mean, know. I mean, the U.S. is testing missiles, Yeah, though. they test the missiles. They are testing missiles, though. Yeah. You know, no they got to test man. missiles. <laughs> Ain't no telling. Because there's ready. always shit popping off the coast of California. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. With the uh, the Russians, they kept flying by Cal. So that's one of, one of the major Navy bases is over there in San Diego. <laughs> that was California, there. though. Yeah. I, okay. So, oh, yeah, you're right. You don't know what the fuck it was. You don't know where, but we so you can't telling. believe shit the news says and the government says anyway. Right, right. Ain't no right. telling. Right. I, just, everybody, uh, I was reading the comments. Everybody, I saw a UFO, I saw a UFO, but never mentioned that could, could have been a nuclear missile. But other articles said it was the U.S. testing the Navy, the, the Navy yeah. testing yeah. nukes and shit, you know. But it's just tell you how much the people is just so much out of touch with reality that they never, in the comments, they never even mention missiles. No. Nope. You know? You know? Real quick. Uh, Isaiah 42 and 13 the Lord shall go forth as a mighty man he shall stir up jealousy like a man of war he shall cry yea roar he shall prevail against his enemies I have long time holding my peace I have been still and refrained myself now will I cry like a travailing woman I will destroy and devour at once. That means he, the, the, the terror, is terror, you know? You're going after somebody in terror, you, you, literally, you are growling down there, you know? Yeah, right. oh, I like got a it. woman in travail, you know? Yeah, like, like how we was talking about earlier, how people, you know what I'm saying, doing all that, doing all the cool shit, doing all that type of wickedness and skull fit. Oh, uh, oh, uh, he, y'all been saying, uh, saying that shit for years. Yeah, y'all been saying that for years. Y'all been out here for goddamn six years. Ain't shit happened yet. Right, Actually, wait. a whole lot of shit happened. A lot, but they're dumbasses. Half the shit, this. half the shit we said happened already happened. Yeah, right, right, right. They like, 
But just four of those dodos, just like it said right here in Isaiah 42 and 14, uh, I have long time holding my peace. I have been still and refrained myself. Now will I cry like a travailing woman. I will destroy and devour at once. I will make waste mountains and hills and dry up all the herbs. Now you tell me that don't sound good. <laughs> right. You know, it sounds like beautiful music, man. It's a let's say it's about time. <laughs> right. It's about time. And I will make the rivers islands, and I will dry up the pools, and I will bring the blind by a way that they knew not. Yeah, only thermonuclear missiles will do that. I will lend them in paths, I will lead them in paths that they have not known. I will make darkness light before them and crooked things straight. That's how it does. These things will I do unto them and not forsake them. Yes. Yeah, so yeah, all this crooked shit out here, they're going to be made straight. We're going to get in the kingdom. There ain't going to be no more adultery. There ain't going to be no more independent woman. Ain't gonna be no more child support, no goddamn license plates, driver's license, no taxes. You gonna pay tithes, but ain't gonna be none of this bullshit. Ain't gonna be no uh, no fucking faggots. Ain't gonna be no public school system. Ain't gonna be none of this bullshit. Ain't gonna be no goddamn democracy, no goddamn Congress. Ain't gonna be none of this faggot shit. The Lord's gonna destroy all this shit. And he gonna set up a king, he gonna set up King David and then above King David is going to be the Lord, Yahweh Shai. Mm -hmm. Like the brother said, no more oppression. None. Not for us. Yeah, not for us. <laughs> not for us. <laughs> <laughs> not for us, you know? Hey, bring that scripture out. We didn't get a, get that. Which one? That Thessalonians. That? We didn't get that. I got something for you after that, too. I'm going to start that. I'm going to start putting down to you. Here, get you on camera. This is Thessalonians 2. I'm going to start at 3, though. Let no man deceive you by any means. For that day shall not come except there come a falling away first, and that man of sin be revealed. Oh, you see the falling away right now. You see the falling away. Like, in this country, they legalize gay marriage. Uh, nobody believes in the most high no more. You know, you got people just bugged out their goddamn mind walking up down the street. You got trainees, you got fucking devil worshippers. This is just bugged out out here, man. Um, and that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition, who opposed him and exalted himself above all that is called the Most High. That's Esau. Esau is the son of perdition. Or that is worship. We should look that word perdition up. Come on. I got a dictionary. This you got? Oh yeah. You got a better dictionary than me? <laughs> I, I got. Which one you got? I got, uh, oh, that ain't, I got the big boy. I got one of those. That one don't go in depth. I got the same one. Oh, you do? Yeah, like one. this one. I bring out the big boys. Oh, Wait a minute, you, uh, um, you got the Bible dictionary on you? Yeah. Oh, you can see if it's in there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good idea. You got, what you got, the Zonderman? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, bust that out. I'm gonna look it up in this one. You look it up in that one. Yeah, because the Webster's, I don't think it really gives you the root words in the Webster's. You got to get the big-ass Webster, the big... I got Something the, like that. No, I got, I got the Webster's at home and just got damn big. Damn. The unabridged. It got That's it. a big-ass book, too. Yeah, I used to bring it out here, but it's too damn heavy. Right. Well, uh, look, 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 look like you got a, a you gotta, bulletproof vest. You got to bring out like a wagon or something to carry that bit. Old school bulletproof like vest. Like yeah. Old <laughs> ancient <laughs> books you see in the movie. Right, to take up right, the whole book bag. Right, right. I, hey I man, when y'all get a chance to man, um, go ahead. I gotta think of doing this in uh, oh, You said perdition. Yeah. Kurt Russell's in a new a new western. Oh really? Oh it's, yeah. It's uh, bad man. That's my dude. It's bad. Eight. They out there in this desert uh, going against some um, um, Israelite cannibals. Oh, you yeah. know how they do uh, Native oh, yeah. Americans oh, yeah. in their movies. Oh, they cannibal. Yeah. Oh shit. It's, it's just bad though. It's oh, it's a cowboy though. movie. Yeah, it's a western. Yeah, he's bad. He man. do good in a cowboy oh, yeah, movie. Yeah, well, everybody was good in this one. I love, everybody was good. You know, I, I, I think I've seen that. Yeah, it's a pretty bad movie, man. It just came out. Well, too. damn, man, I ain't see it, but I think I've seen the preview. Right, right. It's bad, Russell, man. Ain't he still married to Goldie Hawn? I don't know. Maybe tearing that ass up. <laughs> I don't know. Him and Goldie Hawn been together for years. I know they were. I don't know. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah you know she, she was. She was a terrible man. She had a sexy ass daughter too. Yeah, she was bad hurt. Yeah, she go, was back in the day. I used to love Goldie Hunt. Hell boy. yeah, her, she was bad as hell. Yeah. Her yeah. and Meryl yeah. Street. When oh, they was Meryl in that Street. movie. Oh, oh she, that yeah, becomes her. Yeah, Meryl Street. That was fine as hell in that movie. Yeah, man. Meryl oh, Street. Man, oh, man. They was fine in that fine movie. Fine as hell. Both of them. Both of them. Bad yeah. as hell, man. And for the motherfuckers watching the videos, y'all should already know. Goldie Hans an Israelite. Damn yeah, right. Oh, Meryl yeah. Street, too. Because that's one of yeah. the top female actresses. Yep. Ain't, can't nobody, ain't many other actresses better than Meryl Street, man. Now, they consider her to be the best. Hell yeah. Hey, everybody look up to her. Yeah, like, she's bad as hell. She can act her ass off, man. I watched her movie, her, um, uh, Ricky, fine. Ricky in the, uh, uh, Ricky in the summer. She was no, in that's that new one. Yeah, the new one. Man. My mom went to movie, see man. that. She was telling me about, yeah, it's about a pretty a good movie, man. Yeah, yeah. You can she, tell. Her, it was pretty much the whole story around this, this, her. This in that movie. Party and mom that was on the road. That movie alone, you could tell. Death that Becomer? They, they was uh, Israelites. Yeah, because I've never yeah. seen Death Becomer. The that's Isra that's how movie. the Israelite woman like wants to be. Like, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Beautiful all the beautiful time. Beautiful all the time. Vain, you know vain, her mind. I'm going right. to have to yeah. go watch it. But. Always thinking about how she looked and we're always worried about right. how she looked. Yeah, because I you notice know? these heathen women don't be on that shit. Hell no. You no. know what I'm saying? No, <laughs> they, they just let it go, don't they? Yeah, and they, they just go out to the world like, hey, yeah. with. Them like, heathen uh, women, they be looking crazy as hell. Like fucking, uh. Oops. Israelite woman, she don't leave the house without the makeup. That's what I'm saying. She in the, you got, she, she in front of that mirror for two ooh, hours. Uh, fucking Hillary. Like Hillary, yeah, still looking, like Hillary Clinton. Oh, Mar that bitch. Martha yeah. Stewart. Uh, right, right, they got, like, right. I mean, they, it's like they just get up, throw on they fucking clothes and shit, just and go. just, just like, go. no type of. Check this out. You know what I'm saying? They know how to pack that makeup on, man. And then just go. I don't. Like, I don't even like a girl to wear makeup. Yeah, some of that. Yeah, that's shit, that's more, the way they do it now, man. Yeah. it's more clown face. I now. just don't want to. Get, I don't like getting an army, getting makeup all over my beard and shit. No thanks. Yeah, these ones are crazy, man. But that's the Israelite woman. Oh, it's always worried about how she looks. Yeah, I'm gonna read this definition for perdition. Oh, you found we it. We was reading about the sons of perdition, I, which is the Esau. But it's a good definition. Check this out. Uh, the loss of the soul. Eternal damnation. Hey, get Obadiah 18. You want to know what? You want to find out what eternal damnation is? We gonna read o Obadiah. You'll learn what that truly is talking about. It's not talking about, you know, hell. This says hell, but that's not really what it is. What is hell? A hell is a hole in the ground. <laughs> that's right. A grave. It's archaic. Uh, utter ruin. Whew. Perdition means utter ruin. From Middle English, uh, perdition, Latin, perditio. It comes from the Latin word perdere, which means to lose. So perdition comes from the word, uh, yeah, perdere, which to lose. Per, away, plus dare, to give. It means, yeah, dare means to give. So it means to lose every fucking thing. <laughs> Beautiful. And that's what's going to happen to Esau. He's going to lose his whole kingdom. Mm. He's going to lose his children. All his children are going into slavery. We're going to take his women. And then, at the end of the day, all Edomites are going to be exterminated. Now get out over there at Who opposed and exalted himself above all that is called the Most High, for that is worship, so that he as the Most High sitteth, he as God sitteth in the temple of God, showing himself that he is God. Remember ye not that when I was yet with you, I told you these things, and now you know what we hold it that he might be revealed in his time. That's why Esau, try, he thinks he's God. That's why he's got that CERN particle collider. Talking about we found a, we found a, they're looking for the God particle. You know what I'm saying? They think, they think they can figure out every mystery of the universe and search out the heavens. They, you know what I'm saying? God particle. Yeah, the God particle. For the mystery of iniquity doth already work. Only he who now letteth will let until he be taken out of the way. And then shall that wicked be revealed, whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth and shall destroy with the brightness of his coming. The brightness of his coming. That's when the Lord's coming out of the sky. That's that swing low sweet chariot coming to carry me home. And the other part of that is coming to carry me home while he's destroying all these damn heathens. <laughs> we'll have to redo that song and add an extra verse. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't think they did that song right. They got to add another verse. Even him 
Oh yeah, Isaiah 66 and 15. I'll get that. I, oh, I'll yeah. get it. You got it? Because that goes right with that scripture, the brightness of his coming. Even him whose coming is after the working of Satan with all power and signs and lying wonders. Yeah, that's lying wonders. Like all that ge genetically modified foods, all these genetically modified animals, creatures, these lying all the wonders of uh, Jesus Christ. Six and eighteen, you say? Sixty-six and fifteen. And this is the brightness of the Lord's coming right here. Read that. This is Isaiah sixty-six and fifteen. For behold, the Lord will come with fire, and with his chariots like a whirlwind, to render his anger with fury, and his rebuke with flames of fire. Yeah, that's some sweet chariots. Keep going. For by fire and by his sword will the Lord plead with all flesh. And the slain of the Lord shall be many. The slain of the Lord shall be many. Now get that Obadiah 18. Now this is that fire for you right here. Yeah, yeah. When, it, it, see, this is the real Bible truth, man. We're the real Bible teachers. We bringing out the truth. Not all these other faggots out there teaching all this bullshit. Mm -hmm. Teaching about sweet Jesus. Sweet Jesus. Obadiah 18. Read that loud too. And the house of Jacob shall be a fire. This is the house of Jacob. The house of Jacob is Israel. That's us. Keep going. The house of Joseph, a flame. Joseph is also one of the tribes of Israel. Keep going. And the house of Esau for stubble. The house of Esau for stubble. Because the Edomites, they're the ones that control the earth. They're the ones that set this goddamn system up. They're the ones that control the United States. They control all the kingdoms of the earth. Keep going. And they shall kindle... And they shall kindle in them and devour them, and there shall not be any remaining of the house of Esau. There shall not be any remaining of the house of Esau. Keep going. For Yahweh has spoken For it. For Yahweh has spoken it. The Most High has spoken it. The Lord has spoken it. So that, that's perdition right there. Then when we looked up the definition for perdition, it means to lose, to yeah. lose everything you got. Well, Esau, he's going to lose his entire nation. His, the, the whole seed of Esau is going to be cut off. Ain't going to be no more goddamn Esau. They're going to be exterminated. When the Lord gives us that power, the Lord gives us that power, we're going to be uh, partakers in genocide. He's going to use us to burn them up. Hebrews 12 and 16, or well, the points is 17, 16. Is there been any fornicator or profane person as Esau? Because Esau's... Uh, he's a fornicator. He's profane. Just like all these profane people out here are fornicators. Foul as shit. Foul as fuck. No. Just filthy as all hell. Keep going. One morsel. Is it morsel? Yeah. One morsel. Of meat and so, uh, sold his birthright. For ye know how that afterward, when he had rejected the blessing, he re he was rejected. For he had no rep place of repentance. Yeah, because Esau can't repent. There's no repentance for Esau. Though he saw it carefully with tears. He know, yeah, you can cry all you want, bitch. You're still going into slavery. You're still going to be exterminated. Second Thessalonians, back to Second Thessalonians 2 and uh, 9. Even him who's coming is after the working of Satan with all power and signs and lying wonders. Yeah, that's Esau, all them signs and wonders. And with all deceivableness and unrighteousness in them that perish, because they receive not the love of the truth that they might be saved. And for this cause, Yahweh shall send them strong delusion that they should believe a lie, that yep. they all might be damned who believe not the truth, but have pled. Oh, got to read that again. Uh, yeah, you don't believe this truth, damn, <laughs> damn you. That they all might be damned damn. who believe not the truth, but have pleasure and unrighteousness. Yeah, so people, they get mad when we say, God damn you sons of bitches or something like that. But the Lord said right there, he said, damn you. That's what, that's what, that's the book of this. That's a curse. It's, it's not, that's the Bible you're reading, right? Right. That is yeah, in the Bible. I think so. That is, that is the Bible. I think so. The think holy, so. that is the holy Bible. Yeah, I got a collection of comic books at home. I don't think I picked them up. I got a little collection of classics, you know. I got some comics. Yeah, this the comic book. This the ultimate comic book right here. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Hey man, I got some script. We was talking about those angels earlier, right? I'm. A, it still goes into the same thing. Don't even worry about it. They good.
Wait, they don't even exist. Okay, they're, they're insignificant. They don't exist. They're going to they gonna be exterminated anyway. So there's nothing they can even say. They're even going okay. to phase us. Because the, their future is extermination. I'm going to see you scoff at why you're exterminated. Oh, let me get this scripture. Because right now the roaches is running free. You know? Yeah, they're running free. So they're you know until they to that light, <laughs> to that light hit on these little trash scatters. They walk up in that roach motel. Let us scatter. Trash. Let me get this scripture real quick. Uh, this is uh, Hebrews four and twelve. For the word of, for the word of Yahweh is quick and powerful, and sharper than any two-edged sword piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit. Well, that's why people get offended because this word is so powerful. It just hits you like a Mack truck, like bam, like it like cuts you up like a sword. End of, end of the joints and marrow and is a discerner of the thoughts and intents of the heart. Yeah, so if you're a, if you're an ungodly piece of shit, when we read these scriptures, it fucks your spirit up. You, you start getting mad, you get offended. You know what I mean? But that's what it's supposed to be. You're supposed to get it. You're supposed to feel that yeah, way. It's, yeah, it's supposed to feel that way. So you don't, so you can think twice. Yep. Man, I hope it doesn't do. No, I'm glad it didn't happen to me. I pray it don't happen to me. You be out there like Leonard. Walking out and shit. Yeah, he's done. He's, he's more done than what he was two years ago. <laughs> no, he's done, boy. He said he was afraid of beards. I started chasing him, he started running. <laughs> He's really scared of my beard. Holy. What do you say, beard phobia? He yeah. said it's some kind some of word that was a barb like phobia or something. Something like that. Right. Barb phobia. I don't fucking know. I got a script on them angels. Unless y'all had some. Yeah, let me get this. I got two of them. All right, go ahead. This is uh, First Thessalonians 5 and 3. For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them as travail upon a woman with child, and and they shall not escape. Well, that, that's the, what Americans always say. You know, Esau always tells you that America's safe. We're the strongest nation on the planet. Yeah, yeah, Nobody can touch us. It's yeah. peaceful. <laughs> we got the most mightiest military. America's great and powerful and strong. We'll be trying to trick a lot of motherfuckers, too. This shit go down like go down here. Yeah, go I don't there. I, it's safe. I think somebody forgot to tell Vladimir Putin that. Hey, he didn't get that memo. <laughs> so much uh, shit gonna be going on, they gonna do exactly that. Safety's that way, you know. Yeah, safe. Yeah, oh, you go to government. The safe house. zone. Right, right. Yeah. What's yeah. called? Um, the safe zone, right? Yeah. Well, folks that went down in Katrina and. Um, oh, they made you. To, um, they went to. Uh, the FEMA? FEMA, that's it, that's it. And they had this safe zone set. Look, if the government ever sets up a safe zone, tell you, that's the most unsafe place. Yeah. Never go to the don't safe zone. Here. Go yeah. the opposite direction. Trust me. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You, know, you ever watch, uh, what's that TV show, Walking Dead? <laughs> yeah. They had that spot was it the uh, where everybody was going and they was killing people and eating them. Was it called the transit? Not the transit. Oh, yeah, it was, they, it was cannibals in that motherfucker. Yeah, there were was was signs everywhere saying there was sanctuary there. Yeah, sanctuary. Was food, it called sanctuary? I and everybody I, was I going forgot. there and, like fools and they just, yeah, ate. yeah, like cattle to the slaughter. And they was cattle to the slaughter, but that yeah. they went down the line with the bats. With the bats cracking like pow, pow. They slit they throat real so that quick. Slit they throat, drain the blood, and you know cook them up, eat them. Yeah, so yeah, they say peace and safety. Yeah, sudden you, destruction. Yeah, if you see them signs that say this is the safe zone. Man, you better, you better get the fuck out of there. Let me finish this out. Uh, Isaiah 5 and 4. But ye brethren are not in darkness, that that day shall overtake you as a thief. Ye are all the children of light and the children of the day. Yeah, we're children of light. We're the light of the world. Keep going. We are not of the night nor of darkness. People, oh, you got people on the YouTube board. Why y'all teaching at nighttime? <laughs> That's dumb as hell. <laughs> Therefore, let us not sleep as do others. That's like you always talk about when this shit pop off, man. 
trying not to get caught no more. Can't because we ain't gonna be out nah. there miss, in yeah. the midst of these people. Nah. Unless you're forced to get out there. Yeah. You know, some come. Well, we already got that insight. We know we got a Lord guidance. So right. when the shit hits the fan, we already got the inside scoop. You know what I'm saying? We already know right from the rip, like hey, boom. Hey, hey, don't go down there. We like we've been waiting for this boom. Wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of my time. Yeah, wisdom and knowledge. So we already know what's going on. All these people that have no knowledge, when the shit hits the fan, they gonna do whatever the government says. Man, that, yep. and that's your ass, man. And Ever. it's going to hit the fan. Let me finish this out. So, so we, you got so another scripture? Let me finish this out real quick. It really quick. already hit the fan. <laughs> yeah. Uh, now it's just starting to splatter. That's right. That um. All kind of shit. All the cuts is coming in December, man. A whole lot of cuts. You know. I can't wait till they cut EBT. Yeah. All that shit. Cut it all. Well, some interest rates going up in December regardless. They're going up sometime soon. And they just raised the debt sum or suspended the debt sum. Sure did. Sure did. Yeah, they have to go up eventually. They can keep patching it with band-aids like, all the fuck they want. Just like Obama saying raising the debt ceiling does not raise the debt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What do you, what do you dun, dun, dun. Pretty much he said raising the debt doesn't raise the debt. You know. <laughs> yeah. And people believe that shit. Yeah. Eat it up. Eat it up. But who the fuck are they in debt to? That's the question. Yeah, yeah, that's the question you need to ask that. Who if America is the mightiest nation on earth, right. how are they in debt to anybody? We should just go tell them to go fuck themselves, right? Exactly. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> they don't consider that. That's a, tell you, America's not the mightiest. Everything yeah. came to they, they don't consider a damn thing. Shit, if I was the baddest dude on the block, yeah, I'd tell you to go fuck yourself. Yeah, you know? <laughs> like like how he do in the movies. Yeah. Like, I ain't paying you shit. <laughs> he saw this gun toting, gun slinging motherfucking Hollywood. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, you know, you talking about Hollywood? Oh, he saw. Yeah, Man, he, he, got, he got to get Jake to play all them roles. <laughs> Oh, yeah, true. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know, Esau ain't no hero. <laughs> Esau like to do dumb shit like climb mountains. Uh, he was a hero for fucking LGBT rights. Mm, mm, nope, mm. you know what I'm saying? Mm, mm. Oh, yeah. He definitely was their hero. LGBT. <laughs> That's some shit, man. That's some shit. They got a whole word, a whole acronym. Whatever the fuck that is. I ain't even an acronym, that's just some fucking letters. This is some faggot shit out here, man. I right, only read these scriptures. Psalms 34. Psalms 34 and 6. No, yeah, that's right. Psalms 34 and 6. The poor man cried, and Yahweh heard him and saved him out of all his troubles. The angel of Yahweh and campeth round about them that fear him and delivereth them. Remember how he's talking about the angels? How the angels is always out there, always working, never sleeping. You know what I'm saying? It says, O oh, taste and see that Yahweh is good. Blessed is the man that trusted in him. Okay, I want to skip over to, uh, we can read all that. That whole chapter's fire. I'm gonna skip to Psalms 35, just some more on the angels. And this is definitely gonna be talking about Esau right here. And this is the Psalm of David. This is what David said. I'm gonna start from the top. Uh, Plead my cause, O Yahweh, with them that strive with me. Fight against them that fight against me. Take hold of shield and buckler and stand up for mine help. Draw out also the spear and stop the way against them that persecute me. Say unto my soul, I am thy salvation. Let them be confounded and put to shame that seek after my soul. Let them be turned back and brought to confusion that devise my hurt. Let them be as chaff before the wind and let the angel of Yahweh chase them. Let their way be dark and slippery and let the angel of Yahweh persecute them. For without cause they have hid me, excuse me, for without cause they had they hid for me their net in a pit, which without cause they have digged for my soul. Let destruction come upon him at unawares. <laughs> and let his net that he hath hid 
catch himself into that very destruction, let him fall. And let my soul be joyful in Yahweh, it shall rejoice in his salvation. That's funny, you said, pretty much, it said like, he saw, he put that net out for us to catch us, he gonna get caught by his own damn net. You hear that? I'm gonna read that part again. I don't think y'all hear it. It's like that. <laughs> <laughs> the devil's encouraged. He's, he, he's um, he can't wait to bring in his new world. Like he, yeah, he's like he caught, he's got a strong delusion, just like the Thessalonians said. Mm -hmm. Right. He can't wait to bring in his new world. Order, man. He can't wait. He's trying right now. That's right. He sure is. His new world order, man. Part of that new world order is a slaughter, but to all of Israel. Yep. And that's not Hollywood Hogan. And, right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no. Hollywood Hogan and. That's okay. brother Kevin Nash. That's what they do. They put shit like that in uh, the the wrestling show. Yeah. So if you go to talk about the New World Order, people think you're talking about think that. it's a joke or something. Yeah. They yeah. did yeah. condition they motherfuckers to get used to it. They hear that. that. Yeah. You know, they NWO. 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 And they liked hearing it. Yeah, they did. They made the they made they made the new NWO. They made them popular. You know. They made them. Uh, you know, that was a hot attraction, man. It was very trendy. It was trendy. some hot shit. Cause, you know, that's yeah. when I first started liking Paul Hogan, man. When he was Hollywood. When did Hollywood open? Hollywood, yeah. yeah. yeah that's what I, oh, that's the only time I liked him. Yeah, it uh, was way better as a bad guy. Yeah, Black mustache yeah, and yeah. the blonde yeah. beard. Yeah, right, right, right. He, he looked very black. trendy. He wore all black. Yeah. You know? Yeah, they, but new, I mean, they were cool as hell. That was some bad shit, man. Because I remember shit, shit right. when I was in school. Um, you had a group of kids imitating that shit. Kids are saying, we, we, we the NWO. Right. You will have them like, I'm Hulk Hogan. The other kid be like, I, I'm, I'm raising my mind. <laughs> Kevin Nash. Yeah, Kevin Nash. Now they all fucked up now. Yeah. Most high fucked all the motherfuckers up. Yeah, they fucked up. Hulk Hogan, the WWE wiped every trace of memory of his ass. They... The biggest star ever in wrestling, WWE pretends like he don't exist now. That's funny. And he never wrestled for him. Wow. It was funny. He was uh, on the verge of taking his damn self out. And Layla Ali has talked some sense into him. Man, that's some bullshit. Hogan deserved everything he got coming to him. Hell yeah. All the wrestlers say he was the biggest piece of shit. That, you know what I'm saying? Backstabbing, two-timing, wow. double-faced piece of shit. Do what they have to do to get on top. That's how. That's how yeah, it that, is. That, 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 that's cross his brothers. Yep. That's how it is too. That's why Macho Man hated him. Yeah, if you want to get a piece of that American pie, you gotta be a straight slam ball. Yeah, you gotta be a piece of shit. Straight slam ball. Let me get this scripture real quick. This is uh Daniel Daniel eight and twenty five. And through his policy, also, he shall cause craft to prosper all to in his policy. hand. Yeah, that, through all these policies out here, all these laws. That, that's all this wickedness prospers through these laws. These, these wicked-ass court systems hold up all these evil laws. They, you know, like they said, they, they marrying faggots and shit. Faggots are getting married. They adopting children. You got faggots raising up children, raping them and shit. Forcing your kids to go to school all day. Man, HGTV the other day, man. You know, H. Jesse Holmes. They build homes, remodeling homes yeah. and shit. Had these two goddamn sodomites moving in together, and they was building. They had the, uh, the, you know, the people that do the building and the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, the decorating. They was giving them instructions. You know, we went our future child's room this way and that way. And it was two sodomites and shit. That's fucking bad. Two goddamn sodomites. But if you if you speak out against it, you're a homophobe. You know what I'm saying? Sodomites. Just, we're, we're stuck in the past. Shit. Eh. Two dads. There's two Christians, and then they said that they they want their son or daughter to be called a boy, and they got fired. Two Christians. Woo! Well, they just six years old too. They just had a vote down there in Texas. Where is it? In Austin? Somewhere down in Texas. I think it was the whole state of Texas. Mm -hmm. They just voted. They actually had had to vote on this shit, whether they should let uh, transvestites or trannies be allowed to use uh, women's uh, restrooms. They actually, I mean, they rising up against that too. What yeah. the fuck, man? They go ahead and do that they want to. They Texas want get fucked up right now. 
They do that they want to. You gonna have one of them fine ass faggot women go in that man's bathroom. She gonna get her fucking. She, she gonna get her manhood token. She gonna get manhood. Right. <laughs> <laughs> her man. <laughs> yep, yep. She gonna get her She's manhood her taken. Up. Damn right. Because I ain't gonna lie, there been times I walked in CVS the other day and this fine ass faggot chick had nerve to be sagging. I want. I had. I had an urge to literally grab her ass up and just take it. I ain't even buy, I ain't even buy what I wanted to buy because right, right. I, I really felt like I wanted to. I was like, just imagine if all this shit was sitting in the fan right now. Yeah. And she right there. And she right there and like that. In a while. Oh, you talking about a lesbian? Yeah, a lesbian. A bull dagger. Fine as hell. A bull dagger. That's like what you said. Oh, I call what he was saying. <laughs> lesbian bitch. A bull dagger. Busting the sag and everything. Yeah, fat ass and all, huh? Yeah, had But you do see that every once in a while. She had a fat ass. Yeah, you do. How you be seeing me like, bitch, you gonna take my dick, bitch. Because you did make it seem like you said. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. No, could you get. I thought you was about to say. I was listening to you, though. No, no, I know what you said. Because you said faggoty bitch. Yeah, because sometimes, God damn! But some, because you be driving down the street, it happens to the best of us. Especially the distance, you see that distance. My like, damn, she fine as hell. You get up close, it's a motherfucking dude. Damn. Like God damn! It's like that Aerosmith song. Dude looks like a lady. Yeah, yeah, I know, right? You see a whole lot of that now. You but see yeah. it all the time. It's like I don't even say a bitch look fine no more. Tom, like right up close. Right. Like, even then, you're not sure. Yeah, they. But yeah, she this this bitch. She, this was a bitch. Sagging and everything. Oh man, big I, busty ass titties. And a bitch like that deserves to be raped. You I see know what all the time, like up there where you used to live, man. It's like yeah, that's where it's I was all at. All over there now. That's man. where I was at. Yeah, it's all around there now, man. It's like they're moving in all. It's like they just coming out now, man. Moving in, moving in together. Man, that's foul, man. That's just, man. They be look, some of them be looking good as hell, man. That's what I'm saying. Because I, I, I was just trying to go to the CPS so I could like get a little. Right there and shit to sit like ass. With a fat ass. Fat sack. ass. Sack. I'm like, what the? I literally wanted the motherfucking take take that shit right there in there, man. Yeah, but when that shit hit the fan, we're gonna have we all gonna these. We're gonna be taking them. We're gonna have That's all these. That's what I'm saying. Like, all these clean bitches, shit man. Right they now. gonna come to us. You know? You know? They gonna be, you gonna be finding the stragglers in the streets. They gonna give you the little puppy eyes. Yep. And like, <laughs> come on, bring your ass <laughs> over here, man. Yep. You have so many bitches, all these uh, fine ass lesbians, you gonna just put that bitch to death. Yep, probably right, yeah. So many yeah. fine bitches. Might as well just, yeah, you bitch, you gotta go. That bitch gotta pay for her. Yeah, you got, yeah, you're right, you gotta pay. You, know? you can imagine how much shit she talking about a, a man that's out there being a man. Right. You can imagine what kind of shit she talking. You exactly. Know? By your own words shall you be condemned, just like the scripture oh, says. Oh, yeah, yeah, everything you know? that... Let me get this real quick. Why you said it? I'll just get the scripture to back it up. Isaiah four and one. And in that day, seven. Uh, in that day, seven women shall take hold of one man, saying, "We will eat our own bread and wear our own apparel. Only let us be called by Thy name to take away our reproach." This also proves that a man can have more than one woman. Every time you go on the Bible, you gotta be a. Uh, what do they call it? Monogamy or? You can only have one woman. Where's that in the script? Yeah, I, that word is not in the Bible. Yeah, monogamy, that's nowhere in the Bible. That, that shit's totally made the fuck up. I mean, that's the point right there. I mean, that's the point. Seven women shall take hold of one man. Shall take hold. They, 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 Esau? Look at Esau. Man, oh my What's up, Esau? Esau? That's some amazing shit. The weirdos, man. He yeah, he could you imagine hanging out with them guys? Oh, no. Nah. Nah, oh, yeah, I can imagine clowning on them. I, 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 I can't even picture myself. Like, that proves that we are not all the same yeah, people. Yeah, always like, all oh, the whole night. You know what I'm saying? But they're on a whole yeah, nother man. vibration. Whole nother vibration. Another yeah, on, on a whole nother frequency. It's yeah. like, we're like, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Mm. Yeah, the frequency is totally different. Now you gotta have a whole nother receiver to pick up that frequency. <laughs> you can't even pick up that frequency. Right, right, right. That's some crazy shit. Fucking Esau. That, that, that's why they in the, that's exactly why they're in their own fucking world. Yep. And they got a strange world to be in. Too. Yeah. <laughs> strange yeah. world, man. That's strange already. Strange fucking world, man. It's beyond you're in strange. You're a out of place. Like I go to um um. 
the name of the store? Uh, Whole Foods. Up off of Dub up in Dublin, man. You know, because they just built the one up in the east, and I used to go there all the time. Anyway, it's all east all around the area. And walk through the store, you just feel out of place, man. You don't feel like you should be right, there. Right, right, yeah. You Even know? before I ever knew the truth, I would go downtown Pittsburgh. Right. Being like uh, one of them like hotels or something like yeah. that. In downtown Pittsburgh, that's the East Side attraction. Yeah, it's straight East Side the fuck out downtown. It's Pittsburgh. nice down there though. That's, that's why. It. That's why it's nice. And it's like, <laughs> I just feel out of fucking place, like man. Feel out of place. Yeah, because your spirits collide. Yeah, yeah. Like you feel that shit. I can't. You feel it, yeah. That that proves right there that we're not all the same people. Uh -huh. That that's how you can tell who our people is because our spirits. Shit, I even get like that Mess. with a uh, yeah, shit with Jake too sometimes. Shit. Oh yeah. Especially around. Well, that, that's like, a different type of collide. That's more. <laughs> you better get the fuck away from me. <laughs> yeah, no Especially them fuck fuckers around. I mean, it, the area where I'm at is cool, but you still got those idiots. And the two thirds spirit. That's more of the feeling of. I gotta get away from this motherfucker because nothing but evil shit's gonna happen. Yeah, man. Like, god damn, that, that shit. They always mean mugging and just clowning, Mug just clowning, out. and I'll sit there and be like, I'll walk from the corner store and you know say what's up. If, it, if a man give me eye contact, I'm going to say something like, hey, what's up? Right, right, right. They, right, they, right. they, they still, they still walking. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Don't say what's up back or nothing. Yup, yup, yup. I believe it's the spirit ain't right. Because the spirit ain't right. Damn, you like, can always know. tell a motherfucker that ain't, that's thinking wrong, man. You, you know can what always saying? tell. Yeah, like, constantly occupied and evil, like the scripture said. Right. Yeah. You know, you're constantly thinking that way. You can't, you don't have no uh, 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 in, in proper direction. Right. You know, never had guidance growing up as a child because your mama ho. Hey, and right. wicked and evil as hell, hey, you know, and your daddy ain't nowhere around because mama threw him out. So you never, these motherfuckers is always constantly in a fucked up state of mind, man. Yeah. So when you walk by them and say what's up, a brother to them brotherly, they can't comprehend, you know? Yeah, they, they, might wanna, can't comprehend. they might want to fight you just for saying what's yeah. up. Shit. You know? No, what you say, you talking shit. Like, what you, God, what's up? Look, I said hi. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> They say, hey. I said hi. Like, what you mean, what's up? Right, right. Yeah, well, what you mean, what's up? Yeah, what you mean, what's up? You're right, what's up? <laughs> All right. But right. fuck these faggots. Colors on and shit. Yeah. These motherfuckers are children. What set you from? Hey, let me you read it. attracted to colors and shit. Let me read this scripture real quick. <laughs> this is Ezekiel 2 and uh, 3. And he said unto me, Son of man, I send thee to the children of Israel, to a rebellious nation, that has rebelled against me. To a bunch of niggas that have rebelled against me. They and their fathers have transgressed against me even unto this very day. Mm -hmm. For they are Im imputed children and stiff-hearted. Imputed. We looked that up uh, a couple weeks ago. No, that, that's a bad, that's a bad word. Yeah, that's a bad word. Niggas. For they are imputed children and stiff-hearted. I do send thee unto them. They're and, black people, <laughs> you know, and dumb that, answers. I do send thee unto them, and thou shalt say unto them, thus saith the Lord God. And they, whether they will hear, or whether they will forbear, for their rebellious house, yet shall know that there hath been a prophet among them. And now, son of man, be not afraid of them, neither afraid of their words, Though briars and thorns be with thee, and thou dost dwell among scorpions, be not afraid of their words, nor be dismayed at their looks, though they be a rebellious house. Give them the same fucking look back. Yeah, because you know, you might, like a scorpion, a scorpion will sting your ass. But they, they, our people are like scorpions, you know what I mean? You can't, you can't trust these motherfuckers. Mm. But you ain't supposed to be scared of these fools. Fucking desert bug. They ain't shit to be afraid of, really, because underneath that exterior, inside, they just a weak bitch. Yeah, you know, raised you know, raise oh, just yeah, like their mama. Yep. Just a woman like spirit. You gotta be 50 fucking decent for their man. You can still get them in. Yeah. Yeah, they won't say shit by themselves, would they? No, they, they won't say yeah. fucking yeah. never. Never. Do. never. never. Do. Isaiah 54. The Lord God hath given me the tongue of the learned, that I should know how to speak a word in season to him that is weary. He, he waketh morning by morning, and he waketh mine eye, and my ear to hear as the learned. 
the Lord God have opened my eye, I mean, sorry, ear, and I was not rebellious, neither turned away back, and I gave my back to the smiters and my cheeks. Mm, to them, that's right, that's right. To, that's them, right. <laughs> to them that pluck off the hair. I hid not my face from shame and spitting. For the Lord God, for the Lord God will help me. Therefore I shall not be confounded. Therefore I have set my face like a flint. And that means that's why that flint means a rock, whatever you want. What? It means a flint. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. And I know that I shall use the Native American juice for the tip of a spear. That's how you start fires, too. Yeah, flint. Flint's is sharp. And I know that I shall not be ashamed. You he know, is, the real good rock for the spear is with an obsidian. I will go ahead. He, he is there that justifies me. Who will, could, who will contend with me? Let us stand together. Who is mine adversary? Let him come near to me. Behold, the Lord God will help me. Who is he that shall condemn me? Lo, they all, they all shall wax old as a garment. Mm. The moth shall eat them up. Yeah, they just gonna fucking deteriorate and fucking into nothingness. So, these people ain't <laughs> shit, man. We ain't, we ain't worried about these weak ass people, man. We go harder than all these people. Angels 5 and 14. Seek good and not evil. That ye may live, and so that the Lord, the power of hope, shall be with you as ye have spoken. Hate the evil and love the good, and establish judgment in the gates. It may be that the Lord, power of hosts, will be gracious unto the remnant of Joseph. Therefore, the Lord, the power of hosts, the Lord said thus: Welling shall be in all streets, and they shall say all in all the highways, alas, alas, and they shall call the husband to mourning and such as are skillful in lamentation to welling. God damn. And in all vineyards shall be welling, for I will pass through thee, said the Lord. Woe unto you that desire the day of the Lord, to what end is it for you? Yeah, that really goes out to the schools up in the churches. You, all these, you know, these Christians always talking about sweet Jesus, and you know, they always talking that bullshit, teaching them sweet, soft words, speaking them Teach them on that bullshit. Yeah, they, they be telling me, I can't wait till Jesus comes back. Okay. Yeah, they got the whole image of Jesus coming back with Thai candy and flowers. Ooh, and shit. Yeah, I'll tell you. Yes, yeah. And then they got that crazy pre-tribulation rapture and all this nonsense. They just, right, that's what I'm saying. They, they got this, like... Then the Antichrist is going to yeah. come and... <laughs> and they, everything they is... Gonna, the Antichrist will sit on his throne and... Right. He will be the most beautiful man ever. Oh, and that's every, Obama then. What the every, fuck? And every <laughs> that's time, Obama then. <laughs> those church motherfuckers, it's always good news. Yeah, it's always. There's not always. one time always. have I seen always. any one of those motherfuckers on TV or out in the world. Not one time have I ever heard them say, like, Death anything. was coming. Yeah. Like, like, if you don't do what the Lord said, he's going to... Jack you up? Yep, none of that. They don't never say that. <laughs> Nothing about salvation because put it like that. They just they just want to tickle your ears. You know what I'm saying? Just want to. They're like a succubus. Yeah. They just want to exactly. suck you dry. They just want to. They're just like that. They're like a, a prostitute. They're like they a can't. stripper. You yeah. ever go to the strip strip bar? She, yeah, she, yeah. She, she's gonna treat you good, massage you. Yeah. Yep. Why the whole time her hand's right in your pocket? You go she, home like, where's my motherfucking wallet? Yeah, you you gonna call those damn preachers like, uh, call them mama songs? Yeah, yeah. mama song. <laughs> hey, it is the same thing. It's a whorehouse. These churches are whorehouses. They flatter with the tongue. Yeah, they flatter with the tongue like a forked tongue serpent. That's all they do. Man. Because you ain't gonna want to pay nobody no money if you feel as though they talking shit. No, I mean, the only people, you know, the, like they say, the truth hurts. To say, you know, when they say truth hurts. And the only ones they really get in them churches are them dumbass women anyway. And the only men they got in there is those men that the woman dragged up in there. Didn't even right. want to be there. Like, Fall, you know, he's in there falling asleep while the right. pastor preaching. Goes the hell out. That's when my, when, when we, when we went to church when we was kids, my dad was just, every time in church, I look over at my dad. He'd be out, just sleeping. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> this is boring as fuck. Nobody wants to sit through that bullshit, man. Ain't no, ain't no fire. He just there. wait. He's like, ain't when no is fire. it going to be over? <laughs> who, who, who in their right mind would go and sit in there? 
That's the most boring shit. And they got they got the woman put be pushing the man to go in there like she's bringing order in the house. Yeah, she's the order. Like she's order. She's like, strong. She's she's a, um she's Mother Earth. Like she's I know I don't see good. I don't see them like I mean seeing a lot of them Tyler Perry movies like some oh, Tyler Perry yeah, movies. I hate that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, and where the where the woman. Had got the the, the the so called like the dude yeah. and took him off the street and cleaned, cleaned him up. Yeah, cleaned, cleaned him, him up. up. Got his back in order. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know the main people that like Tyler Perry is women. Hey, it's yeah. always women. They be like, you hey, ever hey, be on them bitches uh, uh, internet pages <laughs> and you always see the list of favorite movies that are like Tyler Perry yeah, always Tyler be up in Perry, there. Yeah. Oh, I love Tyler Perry. Top five. He's top five. He's a fucking, he dresses up in goddamn drag. Oh, you know, this devil, this devil got another movie coming out where he's pregnant. That's fucking that, 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 <laughs> Wait, Medea? Like the, the Medea. Oh, yes, shit, Medea. come on, man, come on. That's and Medea, are you serious? Medea has a baby or something. I'm gonna watch it too, just to condemn this shit out of Tyler him, man. Perry. I can't Medea stomach it. Or I can't take that shit. Some that's wicked, some amazing that's shit, so man. I ain't and, seen and, and, you know what? And I knew that was coming next because I was like, they got all these Medea type shit. Bro, they already did it with that faggot ass Arnold Schwarzenegger who's making a movie here. Oh yeah, with him and Danny DeVito. Oh yeah, yeah Junior. It was called Junior. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, he was yep. great. Yeah. So it's about time bitch. they did it with a damn a dumb ass nigga. You know? Yeah, it's about that, time. Medea gets pregnant. Like, oh my god. But no facts. Don't so eat that up, man. But that's just like what Dave Chappelle said. You gotta wear a dress. And dress and drag to be a hacker. It's like this is now fire. This is now. What's the other one? Big Mama's. Big Mama's house. Boy. Big Mama's house. Two Wong Fu. Two Wong Fu. Two Wong Fu. They had them all in that one. Yeah. White chicks. White chicks. Yeah. And they come yep. out with a sequel of that. Uh -huh. Another one. Just a bunch of faggot freak shit. That's all you see. It's amazing, man. That's amazing. why the Lord's gonna destroy this place, man. And, and those faggot movies get like five stars. Yeah, they get great. Oh, they get great, yeah, Oscar yeah, winning, yeah. like right. that fucking that, right. Brokeback Mountain movie. Oh, Brokeback Mountain. Man, I remember back when I was with my baby's mama. She made me Season. watch it. Oh, Lord. Man. <laughs> I wanted to commit suicide after I seen that movie. That, yeah, movie, was, that, 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 that yeah. movie will traumatize you, man. It will vex the shit out of you. You see what happened to Heath Ledger? <laughs> and they had women too. They had wives. Yeah, that's some foul shit, man. Going up to the woods. And the and that, that was a critically acclaimed movie. That's what I'm saying. It's it was critically I think that motherfucker won awards. And it shit, did win awards. Yeah. We should look it up. Look up what awards. I it won. It got five stars. All straight five stars. It, it, yeah, it's 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 Cisco and what's his name? Everybody. Two thumbs right up your asshole. <laughs> <laughs> so you mean tell me a movie that based on two guys going up in the mountains fucking each other mind you they got wives at home it's just it, that that's that's oscar material like come on man and that then, doesn't show you the state like of it's mind. a real tearjerker yeah man, that but doesn't you show said, you the state of my america then and i remember i remember my ba my baby's mama watching that shit and she she's like it's so beautiful <laughs> you know what i mean like bitch it's so beautiful What's so beautiful Empire, about Empire, I've never seen it. They didn't say that was critically acclaimed. You talking about, uh, I oh, mean, yeah, that's just the number of adultery. The new one. The new one. There's a lot of it. I don't want to say that, man. There's a lot of wickedness, wickedness in that shit. Yeah. And what's your, what's your dude's name from that movie, The Light Skin? Uh, Terrence Howard. Terrence Howard. Terrence Howard. I like that movie. Dude from Hustle and Flow. Mm -hmm. That's the movie. Yeah. When he took that bitch, <laughs> he tossed that bitch out the house with her kid. He threw the baby at that. Threw that bitch right out the house, threw the baby out, threw all the He did. Uh, that wasn't his kid, was it? Yeah, was oh, I thought it was her kid. He did that. Uh, uh, he, he, uh, he did that. Uh, he didn't give a damn. He did. That's fucking, a nigga, though. I thought it was somebody yeah, else's kid. That's what I'm saying. Man. I remember that, too. Yeah. He, he had guarded her ass. Yeah, yeah, he threw that bitch right out the house. Get your ass hey, out, bitch. But she deserved, she was talking shit out of her place. Yeah. yeah. You know? He did. He did. He did a Hagar move on her. Right. <laughs> that was the best movie he was ever in. Yeah. And that, that's he's, who, that's he's, who. A, he's a top actor too. Yeah, he's, he's good a, as fuck. I mean, he's got skills, but yeah, he's, he's still a goddamn skills. demon. You ever hear him talking like normal? He's like, "Hi guys, how you doing?" Yeah, like he's from he the talks the like talks like Tony Quinn. From the, and yeah. he actually, he's well, he is from the suburb, and he's highly educated. Like yeah, he's all, so educated. All them top act. Chris Rock. When Chris Rock gets up there, does a stand-up comedian act. He talk. Ghetto as hell. I know, right? When you hear me in an interview, yeah. he talks like a white guy. <laughs> yeah, Chris Rock's a big faggot, man. Oh, yeah, real big faggot. Dude, they're playing Rush Hour. 
black dude. Uh, uh, Chris uh, Tucker. Tucker. Yeah, he's the funniest dude, but he ain't worth it. He got gay in that one thing that Oh, the fifth element. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's some weird oh, that's shit. Like, yeah. Oh, that's got that sexy ass bitch. In it. What's that bitch's name? That bitch that played Resident Evil. Yeah. Uh, Malcolm McKee. Uh, 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 Jovovich. Jovovich. Mel- Mia Jovovich. Yeah, something like that. That bitch is hot. Yo, Mia Jovovich. Hey. You can have it. You can have it. You can have it. You can have it. You can't have it. He, can, he said you can have that plus filled hole. Uh, uh, you know the point is plus filled. Uh, he said plus filled. What's this big scary plan? You see that across the street? That is nasty. What the fuck is that? What flag is that? Oh, so maybe she's surrendering. Is it a yellow flag? <laughs> surrendering. Yeah. Come over here and bow down like your boy last week. What was that last week when dude Yeah, that was last week. Yeah. Oh, he came over. He's like, give it to me. He got on. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Looking like a damn hammer. Yeah, yeah, he did, didn't he? Hammite. Great Jake. His dad was a, uh, he looked like, but the mama was a hammite, so it came out looking burning. Burning. Yeah, he looked like a hammite. Looked like a hammite Bernie Mac with sickle cell. No, what's the other dude that looked like Bernie Mac that was in house party? Bernie Mac with sickle cell. With the baby kids? Oh, yeah, Robin Williams. That's who he, no, 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 the black. Robin Harris. No, Robin Harris. Yeah, that's who it was. That's who he really looked like. Yeah, he did like Robin Harris, didn't he? Yeah. Those bug ass eyes. <laughs> yeah, follow the trip. Follow the trip. Yeah, you never, 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 never do no crime. <laughs> he was talking about that was AJ Johnson too. He was talking to AJ Johnson. Yeah, dude. From, oh, that uh, little that little motherfucker. Yeah, dude. That dude. He was from Food. Was he in that movie? Food? Yeah. Or no, was that was the Master P, The Master P movies was he in them? Yeah, it was the Master P movie. What's that one? I got the hook up. Yeah, he was in that one. And uh, Friday, he was in that one. Crackhead and Friday. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Friday. They they got a new Friday coming out. I ain't gonna watch none of that shit. I don't even watch movies no more. Cause I heard they got a new Deadpool movie coming out. Yeah, I seen the previous that. It looked pretty interesting. It looked pretty interesting. They said Deadpool's a pansexual. What? Not a bisexual. He's a pansexual. Pan means all. Animals and all. Everything. Everything. So they gonna be they gonna use that Deadpool movie. They said it's gonna be a beyond R rated. They said it's gonna be all it's gonna be the freakiest shit. I watch because Deadpool's a very popular character. They gonna use that movie movie to push more of that faggot freak shit. Watch. Yep. He said he's a pan. Because he's so popular. Yep. Right now, really, Deadpool's like becoming the most popular uh, uh, comic book character. Yeah, because he got that like sense of humor. Yeah, kind of look like Spider-Man, but he's parkour. Yeah, he's an asshole. Like he's always talking shit. Yeah, always talking shit. But now they're gonna turn him into a straight-out faggot freak, fucking everything. <laughs> always had that. You know what's funny that too? About comic book characters anyway, all of them are fags. Oh yeah. I always had that. Well, a lot yeah. of the comic book writers are fucking fags. Yeah. You, you know, know what's funny too? And they're a bunch of fucking you, uh, weirdos. After they got a lot of Jake well, audience too. Well, that Deadpool. But they always play hip hop music when the previous come on. Oh and yeah. Shit. I mean Deadpool was a good character. He was created by I was reading them comics back in the day, but he was created by Rob Liefeld in a because he wasn't no faggot when they first created the character. Because they gotta turn him into a faggot. Yeah, you know. You know what I'm saying? Just like they had to turn one of those Green Lanterns into a faggot. You oh see they that? did? Yeah. Not not Hal Jordan, but it was a oh. you know, you know how there's a bunch of Green Lanterns. Yeah. They turn one of them into a faggot. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like they got. They like, had an Archie comic out. book. Now Archie, that's like a colorful comic book. You know, like Happy Times. It's like good time. It's like a happy, good villain comic book. Right, right. It, they had to put a faggot in, in Archie. They got. There has to be a faggot. In, yeah, Archie in that, was popular too. And that new assassin, yeah. Ar- Archie was a popular shit. It was like some leave it to be the car. Yeah, you know, like happy days type shit. Everything's all fun and colorful. And now it's all faggoty. And now we got uh that new Assassin's Creed game coming out. One of the main characters is a fucking transsexual, oh, transgender. Oh, yeah, you were telling me about that. Because it, the Assassin's Creed, that shit is dark, man. It, it's got good storyline with horrible gameplay. All you do is climb on buildings. Oh, they fucked up with putting transgender in that motherfucker. I don't want to see it. I, I ain't fucking. 
I ain't buying that. I tell you right now, I'm not buying that shit for my children. Cause you gotta, you playing as a transsexual? Come on now. So I thought the other one was good cause they put some shit in there about the Freemasons. Yeah, the one with the power one. The, well, yeah, all of them. Oh, yeah, the, 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 the one, one about the like Revolutionary the War. Oh yeah, the Revolutionary War. That one and War. the pirate one too. They, cause it, Power one was fucking it's, badass. This some Assassin Creed games do got a lot of history in them. You know what I'm saying? They got actually real historical characters in there. Yes. Yeah, I was looking shit. I was watching my sons play it. And I seen like the certain flags they had flying. And I was looking them up. And it's like this is all actual based yeah. on real history. Man, you remember the, uh, the very first Metal Gear Solid when you get further in the game. Best game ever. And you found one of them. Actually, when you beat this, get in, you kill all the guards or whatever. And you go in this one room and there's a man bent over Bent over with his ass on. Yep, like they was like they broke the shit out of him. Yeah, yeah, he was, yeah, he did, didn't he? Yep. That was on yep. the very first. Yeah, and actually, very... that's what they, they did. They was raping him. Yep, I remember you know? that. Why else that would he be favorite one Why else would he be bent over like that? Like that. And they had to do a cover this. It was yeah, like it was, it was uh they even showed that too on the third Assassin's uh, Creed with the one with the American Revolution War. American war, whatever. Yeah, that's one. Of, yeah, when you fight the British. When you play as that, uh, boy, he's, he actually, uh, he actually a goddamn. Hey, you, like, don't you like play as a spy or something? But uh, in this one, one of the forefathers he had to meet up with, and he, some little boy came running out. Wow, yeah, I Whoa, remember that. Wow. And, yeah. and, and the dude came out behind him and shit, fixing his pants and shit. Wow. And this was this was in the third one during right. the American uh, Revolution. Damn. That's the one that had, the, I think, the most truth in the money. That one. Yo, watch yeah, the, they yeah, all got yeah, history. Yeah, yeah. Y'all watch the, uh, the original uh, Borgir family. The uh, I can't remember the name of it. But Caesar Borgir, the one that was made in the early 80s, late 70s. Oh, yeah, yeah. The, the one that it's it's got Leonardo that da Vinci in it. I remember. It's on YouTube. That one. That's a badass one. But yeah. remember the part when his, um, Caesar gave his dad those boys? Yeah, as a I, gift. I think I, I gotta watch it. Yeah, I, two little beautiful boys. That's what they said. In the movie. I haven't uh, seen it in like five years. Gave him to his dad, the Pope. Yeah, as, as that's what the I'm watching that. I, I no, it, yeah, man. they took him up in the. Uh, I love that series, man. That's yeah. a bad. That's I, the new one's bad as fuck too, though. Cause they get new yeah, one. Yeah, I remember. Is that the one? Woo, that's sure that wasn't the new one. They brought on the boys up in the pool. That was the old one. Was that the old one? That was the old one. Yeah. That was. Yeah, I remember that shit. I was. That was freaky. Yeah, it was a gift. His daddy is a gift. He could have got all. The, he had all he the had power and money. Up. He could have got all the fine ass woman he wanted, but he man. wanted a little boy. Man, little boy. The Pope, man. Oh shit! You played that original Resident Evil game. 